Welcome to the complex, fascinating world of human biology. Today we delve into the process of labor, a biological event that marks the end of pregnancy and the beginning of a new life. Labor, in simple terms, is the process by which a baby is born. It involves a series of rhythmic contractions of the uterus that gradually push the baby down through the birth canal, ultimately leading to birth. Labor involves three key stages. The first stage, also known as the latent and active phase, the second stage, often referred to as the pushing stage, and the third stage, commonly known as the placental stage. Each stage holds its unique characteristics, intricacies and methods of management. The first stage of labor, the longest stage, commences with the onset of regular contractions and ends when the cervix is completely dilated. This stage is further divided into two phases, the latent phase and the active phase. The latent phase is marked by the gradual softening and thinning of the cervix, a process known as effacement. The cervix also begins to dilate, opening up to about three centimeters. During the active phase, contractions become more frequent, longer and stronger. The cervix dilates from about four centimeters to a full 10 centimeters. Transitioning into the second stage of labor, the pushing stage, the cervix is fully dilated and it's time for the baby to be born. With each contraction, the mother pushes, helping the baby move down the birth canal. This stage ends with the birth of the baby. Finally, the third stage of labor, the placental stage, begins after the baby is born and ends with the delivery of the placenta. Contractions continue, albeit less intensely, helping to separate the placenta from the uterine wall and push it out of the body. Throughout labor, hormones play a crucial role. Oxytocin, often called the love hormone, triggers and regulates contractions. Prostaglandins soften the cervix and enhance the effect of oxytocin. Endorphins, the body's natural painkillers, help the mother manage the pain of labor. In summary, labor is a process divided into three stages. The first stage with its latent and active phases, the second pushing stage, and the third placental stage. Each stage is characterized by specific events and is influenced by various hormones. The first stage prepares the body for birth through cervical changes. The second stage involves the active pushing and birth of the baby. And the third stage concludes with the delivery of the placenta. The interplay of hormones, particularly oxytocin, prostaglandins and endorphins, is crucial throughout the process. Through understanding the stages of labor, one gains a deeper appreciation for this remarkable biological event. It's a testament to the intricate and beautifully designed mechanisms of the human body a process that has been refined and perfected over countless generations. So the next time you hear about labor, remember the journey, the stages, and the hormones that make the miracle of birth possible.